everyone welcome back to my channel it's Rachel Ray here and today I have a very exciting video to share with you this is another sneak peek from Diamond Art Club that we'll be releasing this weekend and they sent it to me to show to you now they did give me like a choice between two paintings and I chose this one because you know yeah you'll know when you see it so let's get into it without any further ado how is everybody doing how are your wallets? <laughs> oh, guys, I only have a few more weeks and I'm going on holidays. When I get back, I'm going to have, oh, my Christmas list this year, I swear, is going to be huge, huge, huge. Okay, hopefully you didn't see that. Whoop, get that out of there. I want you to be surprised. So, this is the inside of the box. Ignore my lamp legs. Is it? Okay. 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 So, let's get this box out of here. So, oh, dear me. <gasps> oh, it's this sparkly box. It's the one with the snowflakes on it. Oh my God. Well, I don't know if there's snowflakes. Are you excited yet? <laughs> so, on the back of the box. No, I'm just joking. Everybody knows by now instructions, details of what's in the kit, etc. You guys, if you don't like big paintings, you might just want to click away because, yeah. But are you ready for this? Are you ready for the, Do you have the inhaler? Because you're going to need it. It's Ariel. Look at it. Oh, my gosh. My phone doesn't even want to try. Oh, my gosh. I'm going to get you a thumbnail. I'm going to put it on the screen right now. So it is a square with EBs, and it's just the same size as Pocahontas and Mulan and all the rest except Elsa. Is that right? 42 by 125. Holy cow. Is it just me or did the box get even sturdier? That's probably just me. This plastic though, y'all. I need help. I need help. I heard there was like a special way to open that, but I struggle through life, <laughs> especially opening packages. Oh my gosh, that box is just like there's big ones and little ones. Oh, geez, you can't even see. Sorry. Rude. Yeah. Oh my gosh, guys. Okay, let's get into this. So I know there's been a lot of Manny Manzano. There's been that new guy, Graham... Graham Grecken? Is that his name? If that's not his name, I'm gonna... Oh, there's two bags of drills. Oh my gosh, guys. Alright, that's everything in the box. Check this out. Luna is licking the bowl that I had for lunch. We have a square toolkit. That means that it's just like the round toolkit, except it has tweezers in it. And they're the really nice heavy-duty tweezers that have like the cap and the pointy end. See the pointy end? Hopefully you can see that. The light has been so strange lately. You get two heart-shaped pieces of wax as well. And I'm just gonna, you know what? I'm gonna just go ahead and turn on the flash. That might help. Preparedness is not my strong suit. Oh my God, I can see ABs. Oh, okay. All right, that's the toolkit. It came in the white bag. I'm sure they're just phasing them out. I don't care because, like, I don't know about you. I don't put them back in these bags if I don't have to. I just, you know, unroll them and put them, roll them, unroll them. Hang on. Unroll them to show you and then roll them back up and put them in the box. And it doesn't hurt them at all. So. <gasps> oh, I just saw another AB. Oh, gosh. All right, I'm going to roll it the other way while I talk to you. So if you don't know Diamond Art Club, they are a website uniquely of their own. They are diamondartclub.com. And they have licensed artwork as diamond paintings. So they get their artists. They make sure that their artists get paid a commission so that those artists can continue to make great art, which is great. How many times did I say great? <laughs> All right. Ooh. All right, you guys. 
So I'm rolling it this way because I want to relax the canvas quicker, but you don't have to, okay? You could just lay it out on a table and it'll just kind of go so gently. But before I show you this canvas, it's gonna wanna roll away on its own. It also comes with an instruction sheet, which Diamond Art Club, I love you, but it's on the box. Save the trees. And then, oh, it's gonna, it's gonna go its own way. Preview, woo! Here is the new sticker sheet. So check her out. Oh my goodness. Daughter of the Sea King. Yeah, it's Ariel. I'm going to call her Ariel. You know I am. Close-eyed Ariel. <laughs> 47 colors. Amazing. Thank you so much for including this. I know not every kit has it, but it is so cool. I'm using it for Pocahontas. Hang on. Show you. This is how I do it. I'm going to zoom you in a bit. Yep. And brightness. Hello. Thank you. These are all the trash drills. That's it. So I put the little label on my Doris containers. Now you could put this on any kind of container that you're using. I just happened to be using the Doris for this project because it was given to me very kindly by a subscriber. And it looks so pretty, doesn't it? Looks so pretty. So anyway, I just cut them up and put them on those. So I'm gonna move this out of the way. That's not why you're here. The anticipation is building. Are you ready? Of course you're ready. Ooh. Whoops. <laughs> wow. Oh guys, look at her. The outline is so thick. Oh, I just saw fun. <laughs> oh, she's so pretty. She looks like she's having a great time. Wow. And her hair is going up. It's kind of like that moment when she's singing um, Under the Sea. No, not the, well, yeah. Well, pretty much every moment. Anyway, let's look at her. Oh, wow. She's very thin, isn't she? <laughs> wow. Love it. Mandy Manzano is a mosaic genius. So here we have her tail and the flowers and everything. Oh, wow. So there's a, a thingy. There's like something gummy on it. Hang on. What's that? I don't know what that is. Um, there is a color list or a legend on this end. And up at the top as well. So while you're working on it. Now, this piece is extremely long. I don't know if it's helpful for anyone to have it in the middle as well, if it's this big. But to be honest, if you're starting from the top or the bottom, by the time you reach this part, you probably know <laughs> exactly which color goes where. But I digress. <gasps> She's gorgeous. All right, let's have a look at for those ABs. There are three of them. Oh, oh. I love this part. Okay, so we have 138, 132, and 141. I don't know why. Anyway, it doesn't matter. 132 is number one, which is all down in here. And I'd say it's in her hair too, is it? Yep, oops, sorry, I just bumped you with my nose. And it's up here in her hair. And number two is like white in her mouth. Oh, that's gonna look great. I wish I had teeth like that. Um, there's a few here and around her arm. Some there in her elbow. And then in the flowers down here. And then X. X. I said that all extra. X is blue. Do, 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 do. Y'all start that Jeopardy theme music. I can't find it. Oh, there it is. All right, sorry. <laughs> it's really light on this canvas. It's actually kind of hard to see. Hang on. 
Oh, look at that shine and that sparkle. That right there, all of that around the F. It is a little hard to see. I mean, once you know what it is, I don't think it'll be too bad, but it's like a light color with light writing on it, but wow. And they're everywhere. They're all back here in the water, all up here in the sides as well. So virtually everywhere in the water. Holy cow, that's a lot of AB. Oh, guys. All right, you saw the drill field a little bit, but like, look at our face. Now, there we go. Our big old forehead. I'm just joking. Yeah, really clear symbols, very easy to read. I actually really enjoy their square canvas. I don't know what it is about the layout of it, but I find it easier to see it than other canvases. I don't know. It's just so vivid. Like the printing on it is good enough that it itself could be the artwork. Like, if Diamond Art Club decided that they didn't want to do diamond painting anymore, they could just sell the canvas itself without the symbols on it, obviously. I'd buy it. Anyway, I digress. Let's have a look at the sticky. Mm. Oh, that's nice. It looks so shiny and pretty so pretty oh my gosh and the back is always soft as usual but very sticky always sticky I like their glue I know some people don't really like it it's very gummy okay but it's it's like the exact opposite of double-sided adhesive it is so easy to push a drill on this sometimes admittedly it can be a little too easy to slide um, and you might have a little bit of sliding problems. But the way to fix that is to leave the section open that you want to work on and just leave it sit for like an hour or two. And like while you're working on it, you could walk away. And I know some people, for some people, that's not possible because they have cats or dogs and the hair might get onto the canvas or something like that. But let me tell you this, because I have a dog and she sheds like a demon do demon shed? Anyway, she sheds so much that every one of my diamond paintings has dog hair on it. Like, I'm okay with that. Some people might not be. But those diamonds go on top of the dog hair. You know what I'm saying? You're not going to see the dog hair. Anyway, I'm going to get back on topic. Oh, and also, I saw it in the group, Crafters Anonymous with Miss Crochet and Coffee and Rachel Ray. Plug. Um, those lines that you can see right there. You see that? It looks kind of like a tire mark or something. Yeah, there's nothing wrong. It's still sticky. Um, and it's not going to just, you know, change your drills or something like that. It's literally just because it's poured glue. They roll it up and then it makes these little lines in the cover paper. And those lines are what make those tire marks. And then, yeah, it's still okay. There's, there's really nothing wrong with it. So let me just check this end as well. Yep, perfectly smooth. Whoops. Check out those symbols. Nothing too confusing either. They like to keep it simple, which I appreciate. Because when you start going like Alpha Omega on me, I get confused. So um, okay, let's look at the diamonds. I'm going to move the camera down so that you can have a look. Oh, she's so pretty. Okay, I'll be right back. I almost opened them, and then I remembered there are people like you who enjoy the sound of the crinkling plastic. So if you don't, please fast forward or mute your phone for a few seconds. Oh, and just for a second, can we appreciate how pretty this is packed? This is not what it's going to look like in a few minutes. I can never get it back like this. Oh, 
Look how colorful it is. Oh my goodness. All right, I'm gonna bring you down a little bit closer because I want to get up close and personal with these colors. So hang on. We got reds. We got ABs. Oh, look at them. Oh, can you see how they're rainbow on top? It's just so stunning. I love them. All right, 310. How many 310? One, two, three. Ooh, there's a round hitchhiker. Four, five, six, seven big bags of 310. And let's just look at them. Perfect. Gorgeous. Some pretty coral. It kind of looks like that AB without the coating, but a little bit darker. That's a really nice color. It's like a Smurf blue. There we go. Mmm. That's a good pumpkin color. This one, 890. It's hard to get it on screen because it's so dark. It's a really dark green. Another kind of coral. 823, of course. I wonder if there's any 666. I didn't actually look on the canvas. Ooh. All right, now let's see. Ooh, more ABs. Look at this color. Oh, that's so beautiful. Oh, I love the way they sparkle. It's so pretty. Another electric blue. Now that one is definitely not true to color. And I don't think I can get it true to color. It's much brighter and... Mm, yeah, smurf, smurfy. It looks almost purple in this light. It's blue, but it's more of like a blue mixed with purple. And it looks really close to 820, just a little bit lighter. More of that kind of pumpkin. Beautiful colors. Look at that. Two big bags of that. 939. Two big bags of that. Piece of wood. That's a piece of wood. <laughs> All right, I got free free trees. Oh, that's a lovely green. Nine ninety one six six six. There you go. Becky, Mrs. Coffee. <laughs> All right, and then we got little bags. Let's go from the mostest to the leastest. Whoop, sorry, I got way too close. So shiny, look at them. Wow, that is very, very yellow. That is like highlighter yellow. That's blind and new yellow. That was pretty. <gasps> purple. All right, hang on. Can you see how purple? Not really. My light doesn't like it. 
Five fifty. Woohoo! So pretty. My camera doesn't seem to like purple. That's gonna be an issue. Two hundred eight. Thirty three. Thirty. Thirty eight. Thirty seven. Which I can never say properly because dyslexia, I guess. Ooh, that is pretty. That's pretty too. Very nice. There they are. I only need like 10 of them. Oh, wow. So sparkly. It's almost like a mirror. Mm, reminds me of like unicorns or something. Walking into Target <laughs> on your day off. Two ten and one sixty five, which I don't know if I've ever seen before. Very nice. Okay, bear with me. I'll be right back. Okay, so closing thoughts on this canvas and these diamonds. So this canvas is just under $60. It's releasing this weekend for VIP. That means Ruby and Diamond level VIP members of Diamond Art Club will get access to buying the new canvases first on Saturday. And then on Monday, everything that's new will be released to the public. So if you are a Ruby or a Diamond member, check this out. If you're an Ariel fan or a Disney fan, if you're trying to get that collection of all the 40, what is it, 42 by 125? Yeah, all of them, check this out. I think it's really good. And I think that to be, to be completely fair and honest with you, I would buy this. This, this not only is this a great canvas. I love these canvases. They never come creased, wrinkled. The glue is always perfect. There's no bubbles or rivers or anything like that. The drills are lovely, vibrant, gorgeous. I love the way they're packaged as well. Some people don't like that they're not in numerical order. I actually could not care about that. You could disconnect these, you can cut them or rip them and put them in order. That's not a problem for me anyway, but just in general, like I think that this for this quality, that price is very fair. And this is a really big pain. Like I'm a hundred and what am I? 172 centimeters tall. And this is 125 centimeters tall. This is nearly as tall as me and I'm a tall woman. That's a lot of diamond painting. Like this would probably, I'm doing Pocahontas right now. And I know you're not here for Pocahontas, but just check her out, right? I've been working on her. I haven't, admittedly, I haven't been working on her very much today or this week. I've only gotten this far. But this is going to take a day and a half. A day and a half? I meant to say a year and a half. It's going to take a long time. And I was like, ooh, I got it first, so I'm going to finish it for, no. No, I'm not, I'm not as fast as um, my BFF, but I think that it would be really, really nice for anyone who's a fan and anybody who likes squares. And even if you don't like squares, you might like squares with Diamond Art Club. So if you want to give it a chance, I've got the links down below once it's released to the public. If you're a Ruby or Diamond member, you'll get that email this weekend. I hope you enjoyed this boxing. If you like Ariel, let me know down in the comments below. I've already asked you what your favorite Di Disney character is, but, and I've asked you which characters would you like to see as a Diamond Art Club painting, because hello. But what I would ask you today, because not everybody likes Manny Manzano and to each their own, everybody's got their own kind of flavor of art and what they find interesting or nice to look at. But I would absolutely recommend that you put down in the comments below what artist you would like to see go to Diamond Art Club. They listen. So please put that down in the comment section below. I'd love to hear your answers too, because I love looking at art. Love visiting museums and everything like that too. Thank you all so much for watching this video. Please give it a like if you liked it, and I'll see you all in my next one. Take care, everybody. Bye!